y'all hey welcome back to my channel it's chris here with keep it up with chris and today i wanted to show you guys a few of my favorite um goodwill finds because let me be completely honest i am an avid goodwill thrifter shopper whatever you want to call it i go there pretty much like once a week if i have gone like two to three weeks without going to the goodwill I'm starting to have withdrawals because I just enjoy the thrill of the find if that's what you want to call it so yeah I just want to show you guys some of my favorite goodwill finds and honestly this probably isn't even all of them these are just the ones that I have found recently that I just am like oh no this stuff got to come home with me so yeah grab your popcorn grab your soda grab your wine because this is going to be like this is going to have you tomorrow or later today whenever you are watching this video you're going to be heading or looking up for your local Goodwill. Let me just tell you. So yeah, go ahead and grab your snacks, your drinks, whatever you need, your little candy. And let's get right into it. All right. So let me start off with the clothes. And I am going to end with the, um, the bags. So yeah. So now today is October the... Sixth, uh, seventh, six of the seventh. One of them. Today is the seventh. Today is the seventh. So to this, this, these items I actually purchased today um, at a Goodwill I went to. So I live in the DMV area, and I was told that the Goodwill in Bethesda or Rockville, whichever area that was, was um, a fairly good one. And I went there today. Um, it wasn't bad. Um, I was prepared to be wowed. So I think that I just was, it was just like a mediocre one to me. But nonetheless, I still did find some items. So I found this really cute Vince oversized, not really oversized, but kind of long. And mind you, I just bought this today. So I need to have it laundered. Like I'm going to take it to the um, cleaners to have it, um, I guess, just cleaned. Have it cleaned and pressed and all that stuff. So it's longer and it's by the brand Vince, which if you know... Um, labels you know that that is a very good brand and I think I paid like seven bucks for this and I am excited to wear this just to the office with like a pair of cigarette pants or denim jeans and my loafers and that's it so this this was like seven bucks and for all of my clothes pieces people I'm going to I am going to try these on and I will have them somewhere here on the side so that you can see how it fits me so next item I got is a sweatshirt that is Zara brand and it's so cute it is it says center of attention and so I have like I can see myself wearing it with like a white shirt under it or um, just by itself with sweats or jeans and my sneakers if I'm just running around um, typically in Zara I don't buy a size small but I went ahead and bought it today because obviously you don't have too much option at the Goodwill but I thought it was the cutest thing and this is how it fits and yeah this was also like I think like $6.50 um the next item that I got so those two items I actually got today this item I may have gotten maybe like a month ago also from Zara um a yellow blazer and I thought this was just too good to pass up and this was I think one of the more expensive items but I think I got it half off um it was half off of 35 I think and it's kind of it moves so it's not like a stiff blazer obviously y'all know y'all know the Zara brands but um yeah and it's longer so I feel like I can wear it with like all black or like just to dress up any type of little outfit so then the next so the next item that I got I did get this like maybe like two or three weeks ago I got this set um, here are the shorts. Um, it has pockets. These are the shorts. And then here is the top, long sleeve top that goes with it. Um, and you'll see it. I'll put it together um, so you can see here how it fits. So I got this is a size, the whole set is a size medium. So yeah, I thought this was real cute. You could dress it up, you could dress it down. Like, I feel like I wish I would have gotten that like earlier because it's getting pretty cool now and it's going to be hard to like pull that off but I could definitely wear it next spring or you know what have you. This was set was only like the whole set was only five dollars. So I also got this super cute little Victoria's Secret 
um it's just a robe so mind you i didn't know I, my sister gladly like pointed it out i didn't it doesn't have the the sash like the tie the robe tie that goes along with it but i figured you know i can always go to like joann's and get a sash that i like but you know it's just like a, a robe to have to like i do like get ready with me or to even just do my makeup in so i don't have to have on my outfit or be naked or whatever i can wear this robe and this was only like three bucks all right and then for the last um clothing piece that i got i got this <laughs> i had this like two days ago okay because i literally i told y'all i go there like once or twice a week i'm i'm gonna I'm a chill though for a minute i'm gonna chill for a minute this is a banana republic this is the banana republic republic dino dylan shirt and so they had this shirt y'all know banana republic is a not cheap they had this shirt with the pajamas which we know is not pajamas um and it was like four dollars so it may have been like six i think but um yeah it has light blue stripes um and it's silk so yeah i am very pleased with this i love this shirt actually and then so those are all of the those are all of the clothing items that i got recently then so let's talk about the y'all need to take a break go take a break because next we're about to get into the bags that i got some of the stuff y'all some of the shoes and stuff that i have gotten y'all would not even believe like i'm actually for i actually forgot because a lot of the shoes that i get i resell them because some of them don't fit but some of them is just like too good to not pick up so that may be a whole different a whole different video whatever but where i show you like some of the shoes that i got all right so let's start with the bags and y'all don't judge me some of the, some of these bags i still even have my stuff in them because i'd be using them y'all like i love these bags so this bag was just this was not a brand i don't think this was not a brand oh yes it was it was chinese laundry and i just really thought it was a very cute everyday bag to use it has a zipper at the top um y'all i still got stuff in it um yeah i just really liked it it was about i have completely butchered it now because i've had it since the summer but yeah it was like five dollars five or six dollars and i just got it just to have you can wear it on your arm just i love the little hardware pieces on it this is the bottom and yeah i just i just thought that was cute so the next item that i got i got this recently um maybe about three or four weeks ago so this is the brand rifle paper co um i think it's just like a cosmetic bag this still has the plastic on it like i'm not not to say that the people didn't use it but it was very very new this was the price tag is still on it this looks brand new on the inside right the price tag the goodwill price tag is still on it and i think i also got like an additional hey baby all right, so yeah, the price tag is still on here, $3.99, y'all. So I want y'all to know that I'm not making up these prices. Like, this is actually what I have paid for this stuff. So I thought this was cute. I actually want to, like, transition this into my purse. I just haven't yet. Like, time be getting away from me. So I also got this Zara bag. Now, I remember when this was in store, maybe about a year ago, this was in store on sale. And, y'all, I bought this bag. And then... I sold it because it was I bought it on the sale and then as I was selling it I was just like why did I do that I want that bag and then I ran across it at the Goodwill for probably like $9.99 and you know what I bought it look Zara these are detachable it's a very cute spring bag if I think it's a very cute for if you're going on like a vacation it just it's just beautiful i love i'm so glad i ran across this bag again like it was like it was put there for me so that is that one and then i also got so if y'all follow me on tiktok y'all saw that i also got this very cute very authentic zadig and voltaire um leather little like moto bag and you can tell by the the symbol embol embolism on it that this is the dig and voltaire very cute retails at about 600 i think i looked up it's on my um it's on my 
TikTok, but yeah. I don't know if you can see that, but yeah. Very cute. So like a, it's like a mini bag, so I don't use it often because I actually don't want to mess it up because I really, really love this bag. It's so cute, isn't it? When I saw this, I was like, I know you lying. I know you lying. Like, are you kidding me? So I've got had that one for about a year now. And then so last but not least, but my, the most recent bag purchase that I got from the Goodwill is this Lofla Randall, very cute, um, mini like belt bag. So I'm assuming you, cause I haven't even, I just got this like a week ago. I haven't worn it. Y'all got this bag for like, so that the Dig Voltaire bag was $5.99. This bag as well was $5.99. And I was like, are you kidding me? So you can wear it like this, like across your chest. You can wear it as a belt bag. You can wear it as a clutch because these actually come out. Let me show you the inside. And yes, this is definitely an authentic Los Randall. So yeah, these are my pieces. So this one is definitely worn. I mean, you can see some wear and tear on the bag here. And then if you take the strap out of the back because this comes out, um, you can see here that there is some, like, a few scratches. I mean, obviously because the people wore it. But, yeah, I just am so in love with this bag. So you can also take this out and put it here. So let me show you. And put it in here so that you can have a shoulder bag. You can take this out and you can put them here and make it a shoulder bag or a crossbody so this is like my favorite purchase right now from the goodwill because i just obviously if you are following any type of fashion metallic is in right now and i just bought a very cute pair of bottega Venetas that are metallic i also have a pair of silver zara heels metallic and so this is just gonna look so cute with those pieces i also have an embellished top that's white and silver so this is gonna look so cute if i wear it like across it or across my waist i'm just very excited i can't believe that i found this like and it also had in the so there's like a little back uh flap here and it had like a cute little mirror i know the people probably forgot to take it out but i thought this was really cute and i'm gonna keep it in there i'm gonna keep it in there and yeah so those are all of the Goodwill pieces that I have right now. If y'all are interested in seeing some of the shoes that I have bought from the Goodwill, please, please, please like this video. Leave me a comment and let me know that you want to see it. And I will make sure I get that filmed for you. Um, I also have a few pieces that I regret buying. But that's a different story because I've seen like Hermes in there. I've seen two pairs of Christian Louboutins. I've seen Louis Vuitton sneakers, but my spidey senses kind of went up. So I wasn't sure if they were authentic, but yeah, they were, they were retailing in the Goodwill at about 200, $300. And I was just like, I'm not paying that from the Goodwill. And I don't know if they're authentic. So yeah, this, these are my current Goodwill finds. If you guys like these videos, please let me know. And I will definitely Every time I have like a really good find, I will try to get them filmed for you. So yeah, um, thank you for watching and make sure you please like, comment, and subscribe. And I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video.